Hello, how do you like my new horse? I told her would change things up and pull the old switcher on you guys. What a surprise. The more I hear it, the fonder I get to this voice. I imagine him as an old cockney English gentleman from Scotland with a kilt and singing sea shanties all day long and even in his sleep. Unfortunately, Mukiki has picked up a venomous, so now she's putting little sully poison lemons everywhere like a dumbass. I think I should be able to avoid them, but she's for that lie, going to kill herself with that thing. She has good server retains recording this level. It's really a simple short level, but with Mukiko and Toe, all sort of crazy idiots transpire. Transfer. Transpire. Wag crazy. Mixed up situation. Will we get into next? Who knows? Might solve a history or rewrite history. DuckTales. Ooh, ooh. Okay, this next room has some green slime, which is the poison. Watch your step. With photos. It's no big deal, though we just run across a little poison stream to continue past. Hardly a challenge for skilled warriors such as me and Mukiko. The next level is our big bat- Fuck. She got stuck in the poison. Mukiko, you idiot. Now this is what happens when you're sad to die. You start over at the beginning of the level. Normally I don't post runs where I don't make it all the way to the end of the level successfully, but I include it this time to illustrate what the game is actually like. This happens all the time. It's one of those quirks that makes Dick a tan a more challenging but not really in a good way. But like I say, it's still better than Superman 64. It's not really in Superb game, but it's not terrible either. It's somewhere between fantastic and atrocious. Fantrocious maybe? Historians will debate this issue for centuries. If you were paying attention and you saw Mukiko run right in front of me when I was shooting my disc, you photolus. This is another problem that comes up a lot. I didn't mean to shoot her, but she runs right out in front before I can react. Maybe Medusa has placed a curse on this level to make things very unlucky for your intrepid warriors. I'll have to tell her to heal up now, because she's about to die. You can see her life bar there in the lower left, by the way. On that stat, Mukiko is a delicate flower. Roses are red, violets are blue. Mukiko, if you argue, that's some more of my Decatana poetry. I've got a 500 page volume of Decatana poetry being published this fall. Available at Foyner retailers coming soon. Okay, we're about close to the point where she did her by for you. I will have to use a different start strategy this time so she doesn't get stuck on a little crumb in a corner somewhere. All the enemies are back alive. I get no credit for my previous accomplishments, but I will revise my start again. He'll try to just duck under this waterfall and maybe Mukiko will follow my example. Okay, well she didn't, but she didn't get stuck that time. All's well that ends well. As long as you're safe, Mukiko is happy for you. This next area can sometimes present more to as to a sidekick. Again they have trouble going up and down to different levels. This is like when Super Clee got all mixed up at the levator in first exit. Hang on, where is the Pico? Come on lady, don't start your bullshit now! Well, we're almost there, and you can take a break in next level, okay? 
I'm now giving her the command to swallow me, which is me, F, T, but um, that doesn't seem to be working. It really sucks when the sidekick gets separated. You don't know where they are and you can only backtrack some and hope you find them somewhere along the way. Damn! She's stuck on the damn ladder! Christ you fucking bitch! Can't you do anything right? Just fucking jump down you fool! Okay now how do I get her off the ladder? Come on Mukiko you can't do this! Remember your training! Maybe if I shoot her, she will get knocked off? Knocked off the ladder, I mean, not killed y'all already seen the result of that. I'll jump on her head! This is like unclogging a toilet. Except I am the plunger and Mukiko is a big piece of shit. Finally! This game presents two distinct types of challenges. One is the challenge of the game, and the other the challenge of overcoming the game's bugs. I guess you can look at it as kind of a game within the game. Can you diagnose the mystery and overcome the challenge of an overambitious plot design? Maybe you have tried and failed. Test sure might if you dare. Well, next stage is fight Medusa. See you then, brave adventurer.